Where's the waterfall here? <laughs> Tour guide said not much water here today. Oh, nice. Yeah, here it is, the waterfall. Another view, closer. I don't think you can capture the uh, the majesty of this or the, the sheer steepness and size of this canyon we're going through here. It's just incredible. Wow, these are some uh, pretty amazing waterfalls. We're sitting here at the uh, the entry point for the boat tour into the fjords, and uh, this is what we see on the on the side. Here is the gift shop, ticket place. This is where we're going to catch the boat, somewhere over here. There it is, a little taste of yours. Now we're going to head across this bridge into Viking Town. Because why not? Because why not? We have 45 minutes to kill. Clouds are descending on us. Electric Ford Fjord tour boat coming in. We're in line. We're going to go on it. This should be a highlight here. The front and up. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it's nice and toasty. We can go to the front. Ah, here's the observation deck. Got to come up a few little ramps here. Interesting. Narrowest of the fjord here, about 250 meters across. Got another waterfall over here. Looks like a little kayak tour here. Came from. Waterfall coming down from the top. Wild. 
wow. Quite amazing. It's even going towards it. out here. See another glacier up there on the there on the right, and another waterfall coming down here at the end. And Lisa's going in because it's cold out here. So here I'm freezing on this boat. Everyone's wrapped up gloves. And we got some kids here swimming off the dock. Tough kids, tough kids here. Well, we're here at an old church. When did they say this thing was built? 1150. 1150, thanks. It's uh, almost like uh, Dr. Seuss was here, as they say. So, uh, we're going to hurry up and catch up with the group. It looks interesting here. There's another, I don't know. I don't know if it's one or two churches. Flash allowed in here. Switching cameras. To step back. So this church is over 800 years old. It's incredible. Can't see up there. Main entrance. These are acanthus vine scrolls. Mm. Serpents and dragon-like creatures and foliage. Wow. I knew you'd be fascinated. <laughs> well, wow, here just uh, know, about half an hour from the end of the boat tour, we see that the colors are changing even more. Definitely fall here in this, in the interior here. Mm. We're starting to get some. Oh, wow color here there were nearly a thousand state churches which is uh, the construction method that was used to create these churches built 
and uh, during a period of about 200 years. Only 28 of them remain. Most of them have been added to, and uh, but this is the one that is the most original. And it usually happens in uh, communities that didn't have the, the money uh, to or the resources to add to them. So, Lisa, what do you think of our trip on the fjord today? Well, it was absolutely gloriously beautiful. I, I can't believe how many waterfalls there are. I can't believe how high the mountains are or how clear and black the water is. Yeah, and supposedly we're on uh, the deep water arm of the world's longest uh, fjord here. And it's so. also very uh, ancho, very narrow. Yeah, very, very narrow. So we can look up the sides, often, um, as you can see behind us, so vertical walls of rock and we were super lucky because it didn't rain even though that was in the forecast and supposedly right now there's showers there's showers in the area but uh not on us i will we don't really know what this costs because it's part of our tour but uh, you know we'll, we'll put that down in the comments we'll but uh, the french is. woman that we were talking to said it cost her 200 euros, euros yeah and so probably know. around 200 dollars yeah but we don't know if that was a one way or two way for her no but uh we'll, we'll put that down in the comments but it was uh you know it's, to me it's you know highlighted to the of, of coming here, you know, something I've always wanted to do in my life, you know, come see the fjords in Norway and, yep. uh, you know, we highly recommend it. Yeah, and so. it's, it's a great, it's a great craft because you can sit inside and not be shivering like we are now. <laughs> and it's got huge windows all around so you can see beautifully. And uh, there's a nice little snack bar with some pretty decent looking food as well as wine and beer and hot chocolate and coffee. Yeah. So come enjoy a day on the narrow fjord. Okay. And until next time, May your suitcase always be messy. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring that bell to see all our upcoming videos. Hasta luego.